Question 19. Separate samples of magnesium and calcium are added to excess dilute sulfuric acid. The observations are summarized in the table. Magnesium. Vigorous reaction. Bubbles of gas produced. Of that, magnesium completely dissolves. For calcium, vigorous reaction initially. Bubbles of gas produced. But the reaction soon will stop. And most of the calcium unreacted. Some of you might uh, think uh, about the, the reactivities of the group 2 down the group. So calcium is more reactive than magnesium when it reacts with water. But this is different. So in this question, both metals now react with sulfuric acid. So not water, it's the sulfuric acid. So first, you need to know what happened during the reaction for the calcium. For the calcium, after it reacts with the sulfuric acid, it will form gas, hydrogen gas, and at the same time, it will produce calcium sulfate. So please remember, calcium sulfate is a solid. So it means it's, it's going to be a solid or the precipitate. So, and this solid will block the metal surface. Once it's formed, it will block the metal surface and the calcium cannot further react with the acid. That's why the reaction will stop and most of the calcium unreacted is because of this calcium sulfate. So therefore, answer is D. Magnesium is more soluble than calcium sulfate, yes. Because magnesium sulfate is soluble and it's form aqueous solution. It will not block the magnesium metal surface. Because calcium now is a solid, it's not really that soluble. So therefore, block the calcium surface and let most of the calcium unreacted. That's the reason why. So, for question 20, Dolomite is a double uh, carbonate, so it's a calcium magnesium carbonate. And uh, it can be used instead of calcium carbonate for treating acidic soils. The three statements all refer to the agriculture use of this carbonate. So the first statement, Dolomite and calcium carbonate are both less soluble than calcium hydroxide. Yeah, it's true. Uh, please remember, all carbonates, uh, in this case is group 2 carbonate, group 2 carbonate less soluble than the hydroxide. This is for sure. So, carbonate, group 2 carbonate is highly unsoluble. The solubility is very, very low. So the statement one is correct. Statement two. One mole of dolomite has the same neutralization effect as one mole of calcium carbonate. Uh, this is not really true because uh, one mole of dolomite is actually has double carbonate, double carbonate. So the neutralization is, or, or the neutralizing effects. Uh, they are different. So we can say that uh, because it has more carbonate, uh, I mean the dolomite, so uh, it has a better neutralizing effect. So the second statement, wrong. The so last statement, dolomite and calcium carbonate both increase the pH of acidic soil. So first, you need to know 
all these carbonate will react with the H plus or hydrogen ion in the soil. So after that, the concentration of hydrogen ion decreases and the pH will increase. So therefore, yes, because both they are carbonate and it will react with H plus, H plus lesser, so pH will increase. So therefore, the last statement is correct. So answer is B. Okay, that's all. Thank you.